Hello everyone, this is Tawana from Llama Index, and I want to walk you through the Llama Cloud MCP server that we created, which is completely open sourced. And this is the one that we created in Python, uh, which allows you to use Llama Cloud indexes and extraction agents as tools within any MCP client. And today I'm going to show you how um, you can set it up to use with Claude Desktop, for example. So to start with, let's have a look at my Llama Cloud account and you'll see that, for example, here I have two indexes, uh, one uh, Google Drive index. This is connected to a Google Drive that has some information about Llama index workflows. Uh, another uh, index called filings. This has SEC filings in there. And then if we go back, we can also have a look at the extraction agents I have. I have an invoice extractor. And later on, we can maybe add another extraction agent, which will automatically be used as an MCP tool itself. All right. So what is behind the Llama Cloud MCP server written in Python? Well, let's have a look. So here is the config of our MCP server. The way you can use this is simply define any of the indexes you want to use. So here I have defined two and you give it the index name. So for example, my Google Drive index and then colon and you provide it with a description. This description is super important because it'll be what uh, Claude or whatever MCP client and LLM you use. It will use this description when deciding which MCP tool to use. Next, uh, I have another index for filings and I'm going to be using my invoice extraction agent as well. Uh, the other thing we need to use with Llama Cloud MCP for now is the file system uh, tool. Um, and for example, here I've given this file system tool access to a specific folder in my uh, on my machine. And here I have a couple of files that I can use with my tools. All right, so this is very simple. The only config you need. Once we have that, we can go and say start Claude and let's have a look. You'll see that we have the file systems tool and also the Llama index doc server. This spun up three tools because I have three things from Llama Cloud that I've given access to. Uh, my querying for the Google Drive index, the querying for the filings index and the extract invoice extractor. So let's see this in action. For example, let's say, okay, so basically I'm going to ask Claude to hopefully make the decision to pick the right file in my folder. And hopefully it'll also tell me who the invoice was for. For context, this is a demo invoice that we're using. So we can see that this was an invoice to um, someone called John Smith for a few items. And let's see if Claude uses it correctly. So now we see Claude trying to send my invoice example.png to the invoice extraction agent. We can also see the result from the extraction agent. And finally, uh, we see that the invoice was for John Smith. That's correct. And we have some extra information that we got from our extraction agent. Next up, I want to show you how you might add your own tools. For example, let's have a look at adding another extraction agent. So within the folder that I've given uh, the file systems tool access to, there's also one of my old CVs. So let's create, for example, a CV extractor. Let's configure this. Um, let's say I want multimodal and let's say that we want to use one of the pre-built built technical resume. Um, configs and let's publish this configuration. And once that's published, we then have an other agent within my extraction agents and I've, it's called the CV extractor. So let's copy that, copy that name. And then let's go back to our config. So I want to add another extract agent and it's called CV extractor. And I can say extracts info from resumes and CVs. 
and that's it. Now, if we restart Claude, we'll be able to see that we have now four tools. We had our previous tools, but we also have a tool called Extract CV Extractor. Now let's try something a bit more complex. Let's try this thing where I'm asking for two separate extractions. I say, I need you to look for the file that has the word invoice in it and extract info from it to tell me who was invoiced. I also need you to run my CV through the CV extraction agent to tell me the listed emails. The file should have my name in it. So let's hope that Claude gets this correct as well. So it identified the two correct files and it identified which was which. So first we're running it through the invoice extractor. And now that the CV extractor is running, we can even go and check that there is a extraction in progress. Now the extraction is done. So Claude should soon have a response from my CV extractor agent. Once we have a response from our CV extractor agent, we can have a look at the exact response within this chat UI, but also Claude will generate a response based on the first question we asked. This is my listed email, which is correct. Um, but the idea behind this MCP server is that you can convert any tooling you have within your Llama Cloud uh, project and add them as extra tools to your MCP server. You can add as many extraction agents and as many indexes that you wish. Here we have two um, indexes and two extraction agents that we used. And on top of that, the great thing is that your indexes will always be using the Llama path setup that you created the index with. Some additional things we can add to this open source MCP server is the ability to making use of the file systems tool. We could potentially use or create a tool that allows us to write new files and new data into existing indexes, which has not been implemented yet. With that, hope you had fun. Please check out the code. Any contributions are welcome and let us know what you think.